what's in my backpack for school. I don't know why I got it, but I got it anyways. Welcome back to another vlog. I'm super excited. I got my nice hot water that I always drink every morning. It's extra nice today because it's actually cold today. Now that it's the end of August, it's gonna be September, which means that school's gonna start, which also means that the weather is gonna be a lot colder so I can wear sweaters without feeling like I'm being baked alive in an oven. So yeah, I'm really excited. I'm not really a summer person. So this is like the perfect time of year for me. And just the main thing is that school's gonna start soon. So it's just a good time. It's just a good time. But yeah, I have to get some work done. So I'm gonna finish my water and then go work. I wanted to just quickly show you guys my Notion. I updated it a little bit from the ones that I've had in the past. If you guys ever want to use it, I'll put all the links to the templates and whatnot in the description, but this is going to be the same exact setup, like digital planning setup that I'm going to be using for school. There's just three different sections where you can put pages for things like school, work, or just like yourself. So things like things that you want to learn or just like writing down the shows that you've watched. It's very simple. It's just split into a monthly planner and a daily planner. The one that I usually use the most is the weekly planner. This is where I'm planning everything. There's a bunch of little Little buttons that you can press that allows you to add like a new to-do list or like a new planner and everything and there's like little folders where you can drag and drop everything into but yeah i'll link all of these in the description it's not sponsored or anything but just in case anybody wants to use the same resources as me Okay, so I'm gonna be making some breakfast right now i'm gonna have some egg drop soup very simple very quick breakfast for me I'm just gonna take out the dried seaweed in it. Now that the broth has been boiling for about like five to 10 minutes, and I'm gonna add just a couple things to add a little bit more flavor. I'm just gonna add some fish sauce, and then a little bit of soy sauce. And then lastly, I'm just gonna add some of this rice vinegar. So it's rice wine vinegar. The broth is pretty good by its own. I'm pretty sure like you could probably have this with like somen or like soba noodles, but I like to add a little bit more flavor. Very simple, took me probably like 15 minutes to make. I also really like having it with rice because rice is just the best. I got a package today, which I'm so excited about. Oh my gosh, this is such a cute bag. Holy crap, I like can't, this packaging is so cute. Holy crap, like I'm gonna explode. What? There's like stickers and stuff. It comes with little stickers in the back.
I'm so excited to share with you Divoom's latest pixel art Bluetooth speaker with a mini karaoke machine. I'm pretty sure you guys have probably seen the classic Divoom speaker on nearly everyone's desk setup on social media, and I would definitely agree that it's a really cute but also very versatile product to have. You can select pixel art to display from the huge collection on the Divoom app, or you can even customize your own. I have these two cute cats on mine. This also functions as a speaker with 360 degree surround sound, and it has an incredible bass duct to provide providing amazing sound quality. I've blasted so many New Jeans and Drake songs on this and it sounds amazing. And of course, this also comes with a professional level microphone. It has six different modes, so this is great not only for your desk setup, but it's also amazing for entertainment as well. Baby, on my not to mention, there's tons of other features like games, an alarm clock, and even an atmosphere light. If you guys are interested, I do have a link where you can get 10% off. I'll leave all the info in the description. Thank you so much to Davoom for sponsoring this portion of the video. Currently at TNT, the usual Asian supermarket, grocery shopping, you know how it goes. This is my weekly routine. <laughs> couple things that I wanted to try, like this bun, and then I also got some sushi and some eggs. Okay, I'm back home. I just changed into more comfy clothes, but I'm gonna be eating the bolo bun that I got. It kind of got smushed in transit, so yeah, I'm sure it still tastes. Okay, so we went to a couple different places today to mainly just go back to school shopping. Me personally, I didn't actually need school supplies. Like as a university student and as a comp sci student, most of the notes I take are digital notes. So yeah, I didn't actually need like anything like pens, papers, all that stuff. But I ended up picking up a couple things as well. So this is gonna be my quote unquote back to school haul, but it's not like actual school supplies. It's literally just like a bunch of beauty products and like random things. So yeah, we went to the Asian grocery store and I actually picked up some false lashes. I haven't worn false lashes in like three years. But yeah, I don't really know. I've never seen this before, but it was at TNT and I thought it was cute. It's from this brand. We went to the dollar store and this is like, I don't know. I don't know why I got it, but I got it anyways. It's this Deadpool figurine. <laughs> I, yeah, I don't know why I got this. I'm gonna put it on my desk. Look at it. It's so cute. <laughs> the little sign just says, let me out of here. Love it. Okay. And then I picked up a bulk of the things from Walmart. So I just got some new mascara. This is the Maybelline Falsies mascara. And then I just got some concealer. And of course I had to pick up some lash glue for the lashes that I got. So I just picked the classic duo lash glue. I got some eye makeup remover. I actually like really need eye makeup remover recommendations. There are some waterproof mascaras that are so hard for me to get off. So if you guys have any recommendations, please let me know. But yeah, I just got the generic like clean and clear eye makeup remover. So hopefully this works, but I don't know, I haven't tried this before, so we'll have to see. And then I ended up just picking up a nail file and a new nail polish. This is, yeah, not really that important, but I needed a new nail file and I wanted a new nail polish. This is the one that I got and it's called Ring Bearer. It's such a cute color. But yeah, that's my little haul and that's the stuff that I got from today. That's my little mini back to school haul. <laughs> It's 10.54. I'm making myself my breakfast right now. I'm waiting for my English muffins to finish toasting. I'm gonna have that... Oh. 
I'm gonna have these English muffins with some peanut butter and banana. And I'm also gonna add a little bit of cinnamon on top. This is my lovely breakfast, very quick and easy. Okay, so really quickly i'll show you guys what's in my bag what's in my backpack for school honestly speaking i think i'm like emotionally attached to this backpack because i just won't let it go yeah i've literally had this one since like 2018 so i don't even remember like literally where i got this but it's this backpack i have the sasuke keychain on it and i also have these little headphones that my friend laura gave me my absolute essentials to take with me to school is my laptop this is the macbook pro and then i also like to bring my window surface go with me it's also like a laptop but i use it more so as a tablet to write my notes like if i'm doing any math notes and stuff and then i have my macbook charger i also bring with me a usb cable for my phone and i actually also take this like extension with me for my macbook i have the charger for my tablet and I also take this with me. It's a portable laptop stand. This is the one that I actually use on my desk. So I only have one, so I just like take it with me, but it's really... Well, this actually has a case, like a little pouch that you can put it in. I just don't know where I put it. It's like somewhere in the depths of my closet. But yeah, I take this with me because I'm extra and I like to have my laptop elevated, so... I have my AirPods. This is just the normal, regular AirPods. I have my wallet. It's my Jujutsu Kaisen wallet with my Tata keychain. <laughs> and then my water bottle. This is just a basic blender bottle, so yeah, nothing special to it. But yeah, that is usually what I take with me to school and what I have in my backpack. It's actually a lot because sometimes I also bring lunch with me, so it's actually a lot. The bulk of my backpack is literally just from my laptop. Like this MacBook weighs so much. Well, not so much, but it's just pretty heavy because I also have a case on it. Anyways, that is what I have in my backpack. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video today. I'm so excited for next week. I'm pretty sure next week will definitely be one of my first week back to school, like uni vlogs. So it'll be so fun. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.